Hi, um, I'm Alfonso Calero. I'm based in uh, Sydney, Australia, and I run workshops all over the world. Um, I was born uh, in the Philippines, but I'm of Spanish descent, so I go to the Philippines on workshops. Um, my wife is from Tokyo. I used to live in Japan a long time, so I go to Japan a lot. Um, and I'm also of Spanish origin, so I go to Spain a lot. But uh, since COVID uh, came uh, this time last year, uh, I've been uh, stuck in, in Australia. And uh, I, of course, I also run lots of workshops here in Australia. And I hope that all of you viewers out there are all safe and sound at this point in time. And I hope I can also offer you some inspiration to uh, to educate you in uh, my passion for photography. So I have various workshops as mentioned, but I just want to show you one particular one that's here in Sydney. So it's a live stream one to so try and make you nothing better than face to face, but I'd love, love to give you a sense of this place and uh, also teach you about smartphone photography. So anyone with a, uh, with a mobile camera, uh, you can join me on one of my uh, smartphone tours. And so I'm just gonna, jump right into uh, my website here. And uh, so my website's my, my name, alfonso.com.au. And uh, I just wanna share that uh, with you here now. So you can see we've just jumped into uh, the website and uh, just on the top right here, we've got the menu and uh, we've got also there's an ebook here that you could download if you sign up. It's a free uh, travel photographer's essential guide. Uh, you can find that within five seconds of being on the on the website. It, it'll pop up. But um, just up here on the top right, I've got live streaming options, and um, I'll take you to uh, the one that I, I wanted to show you about. There's a few that I'm doing at the moment, uh, maybe just to uh, distract you of what's going on in your own world. You might wanna join one of my uh, live streaming clashes. Have a look, they're very affordable. These are all priced in Australian dollars. Uh, your dollar is stronger than ours. Um, so, uh, and then down here, there's one I do live uh, on location at Sydney Harbor. So, uh, just gonna punch that in, live stream. So uh, this one goes for an hour and uh, you can see the pricing there. And we just show you how to use your smartphone and uh, edit as well while you're on the go. We use Snapseed for editing. Now, if you feel you're probably more of an advanced shooter and you wanted to consider coming to Australia one day when, when the coast is clear, um, I'll take you through to some of my uh, gallery shots. So yeah, as mentioned to all of you there, there's the live stream option. And then if uh, and when we can, uh, the borders are open, uh, you can have a look at my gallery. That's on the top right. There was a gallery link. And uh, you can see here, I've got tours in Japan. I'm fluent in Spanish, Filipino or Tagalog and uh, Japanese. So um, uh, these other countries are my second homes uh, aside from Australia. But um, let me take you to uh, Tasmania in Australia, just to give you a taste of, of the, the work that I do here. Tasmania is uh, down south, an island that looks like the shape of an apple called the Apple Isle. And uh, as you can see, there's so many beautiful locations for landscape photography, which is what I focus on when I go to Tasmania. Um, this place here on the left is called uh, Cradle Mountain and uh, Dove Lake is the lake that we shot this um, Milky Way from. And to the right, there's this uh, other area called Strathgordon in Southwest Tasmania. So um, there's a great variety of landscapes here. If you come in summertime, summertime in Australia is in January. So de December all the way through to February perhaps. And we got lavender fields. Uh, we also have a beautiful uh, national park to the right. You've got a fit photo of the jetty at uh, Freysenet. And, um, and there's lots of variety of landscapes. So you could be shooting uh, uh, waterfalls in subtropical rainforests uh, all the way through to beautiful seascapes with uh, this lovely uh, orange lichen on the rocks. Um, yeah, and so there's a, a great variety, as you can see here, seascapes, lakes, 
rivers, uh, and uh, even um, some beautiful highland lakes here where there's all these sort of dead trees in the water too, quite a mysterious looking area. Um, and uh, we have many other locations. These tours usually run for about um, seven days. So if you're coming to Australia, please consider having a look at alfonso.com.au. Um, another quick look at um, some other tours I have within Australia is Uluru. Uluru, as you know, is also known as Ayers Rock. And uh, this is the, uh, where the first Australians have lots of um, private land. And as you can see here, the Aboriginal gentleman on the right. So we have some opportunity for portrait photography uh, and of course, landscape photography. It's in the middle of Australia. So it's very desert-like. And these are usually great to visit uh, from around June to uh, October. So for us, June is actually winter. Um, it snows in Australia, but of course it doesn't snow out there in the desert, but um, it's a great time to be shooting some uh, astrophotography or Milky Way photography. So here again, just a little taste of what I have available in Australia. Great. Looks great. Yeah. I mean, you have a, such a wonderful pictures there that make people go there and take start taking pictures. To find Alfonso's photography workshop, go to the workshop finder, workshop-finder.com. Here is the Workshop Finder website where you see art workshops, photography workshops, writing workshops, and music workshops. Go to the photography workshops and tours. Here's all the listings, year-round listings first. And here's uh, Alfonso's photography workshop, live streaming smartphone photography, Cine Opera House and Harbor Bridge, hosted by Alfonso Claro Photography. Learn how to shoot and edit on your smartphone. To get more info, click here. Then you go to Alfonso's own website where you see all the details about his workshop and you can sign up for the workshop. So this is it for today. And uh, thank you so much again and see you soon.